Yeah, it's it's surreal to see it through. It's tough to answer these questions right now. Vinny in the center, third row. <clears throat> Vinny Benedetto with the Denver Gazette. Jamal, Nicola famously said that he expected you to suck for the first 20 games of the regular season, and there was all the talk about, is Jamal back, is he not back? How, how, how frustrating was that for you to deal with, and does that make this moment even sweeter to kind of have people, I guess, questioning your ability to return? Yeah, um, I knew I was going to suck for the first few games. Like I, I had to live with that. I, I knew I wasn't going to put up 40, 50 points in the first couple games. I always say if you go back to the first game in Utah, I, I picked up the ball in the paint like five times I could count. Like I, I was so lost. Um, I had never felt being that lost on the court before. I just didn't want to go into the paint um, or jump or land or uh, feel contact and um, just how far I've come from that moment. You know, I still have different moments where I, I'm tentative, best word for me to put it, um, to do certain actions, you know, rebounding among everybody or um, but I've just gotten so much better at that and just putting that behind, you know, not just me, um, Mike too. You know, I think Mike, I shout out to Mike. He's gone through so many different injuries and just see him constantly um, stay locked in, be a team player and grow his game um, in different aspects to have an all around game. You know, even if he's not shooting well, uh, it's just really great to see the growth of this team. And um, yeah, that first game in Utah, I was, I was, uh, I don't want to say scared because I wasn't. I was confident, but I was so tentative in everything I was doing. And to see from that game to this game to the finals game where I've come, it's just, um, I'm just, uh, yeah, I'm just happy for myself. Om on the left here. Uh, Om Young Sugi has been. Congrats, Jamal. Appreciate it. Um, there's all this negativity for whatever reason surrounding the MVP race around Jokic.